Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. What? Are you recording? Yeah, I'm recording. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I am with Caleb. Hi. The infamous Caleb. I guess it's not infinite, infamous, but okay. So we had an idea that we didn't think of. There's a whole YouTube community that watches and reacts to like very famous movies and I'll link a couple youtubers below that does this but I recently just finished the first two Harry Potter books and Caleb is a huge Harry Potter fan and that was just one of the things that whenever we started dating he was like you should read the Harry Potter series so I was like okay so I finished the first two and we're planning on watching both of them this weekend but we're gonna react to I'm gonna react to watching the first movie, Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, for the first time. And he's already seen it, so he's like, you, you're getting both perspectives here. Does that make sense? Caleb's gonna ask me some questions, I think. <laughs> and he is not a YouTuber, so you just have to, I don't, bear with him, but also. Yeah, bear with me, please. Yeah. I love YouTube, though. Yes, he does. He That was one of the things, like, Whenever we first started dating that I loved about him was he was so supportive of my YouTube and he's been commenting on my all my videos. I'm sure you guys have seen him in the comments. So be nice to Caleb because he we we've been really excited about this, but I think that it's just like one of those things we just have to do it the first time. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then it'll get easier as we we keep doing it. All right. So Is it recording? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So what parts of the book are you most excited for to see in the first movie? Okay, so I'm definitely really excited to see the Quidditch tournament, but I did make a confession to Caleb. I, okay, so I, I might have watched the first Quidditch match on YouTube whenever I was reading the book, but I swear that's the only thing I've seen. The only thing I've seen is the Quidditch match because whenever they were describing how the game worked, I was like, I have to see what this looks like adapted to film. And also, I wanted to understand the game better because it's kind of confusing when you're like first reading it, you know? And so I watched the Quidditch match, but I'm excited. I didn't watch it in its entirety. I just watched whenever he first like soars out and he like soars around the whatever and then the game mm -hmm. starts. But after that, I stopped. Um, <clears throat> I'm really excited for the, well, all the mirror scenes, but especially the mirror scene, like the first mirror scene, whenever he goes with Ron and he's like, look at this mirror, like, what do you see? And he sees his parents, but Ron sees like him winning the Quidditch Cup or whatever. Mm -hmm. So I'm excited to see that. I'm excited to see um, Quarles, Voldemort head. Yeah. I think that's going to be super weird. And when did this movie come out? Uh, early 2000. 2001, this movie came out. So, so what do you think of the special effects in this movie? Here, I'll turn it around. Yeah, so for when they came out, this, I mean, the special effects were really good. They continuously get better. So you think they're good in this movie? For 2001, yeah. Okay. See, I thought you said that the Voldemort head is, like, not it, good. It looks kind of goofy. Okay. But for what it is in 2001, you know, it's uh -huh. believable. It looks yeah. good. Um, is there a character that you're most excited to see on the screen that you maybe, like, connected to in the books? Um, well, definitely Hermione. But I see he has it on. Show your TV right now. He has, like, the... The, like thumbnail of the movie so I already know like what Hermione looks like also from like pop culture like I know what Ron Hermione and Harry look like but it's like the other characters I don't have any idea what they look like like what is Miss McGonagall McGonagall Professor McGonagall yeah what does she look like yep what is Quirrell gonna look like I feel like I know what Snape looks like from like pop culture doesn't he have like short black hair yep so that was that was played by Alan Rickman and he's who's, dead now. Yeah. That's he funny. passed away a couple years ago. He's in a lot of movies. He was a bad guy in a lot of 80s action movies. Mm -hmm. Phenomenal actor. Mm -hmm. He's probably one of the best actors in these movies. Um, the ca <laughs> casting's phenomenal. And they don't have the... So I've been talking about how I've been reading. You guys know that I read on my lunch break at work. So I've been reading the Harry Potter book at work. And there's a couple guys at uh, work that also really like Harry Potter. And he was telling me that the ghost is not in the movies the whole time. Peeves? Peeves. Yes, Peeves is not. When I used to play the video games, Peeves was a big character. He's not in, in movies at all. And it's strange because he's a big character in the books. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to start the movie. I'm going to, just like copyright reasons, I can't just like play the whole movie. 
so it'll definitely snip it through as we go um so definitely go watch the movie or read the book before in my opinion before watching this i mean you can watch it of course but just know that like you're not going to get the full effect um because it's going to be like snippets of the film if that makes sense so ready to get started let's get started okay Dark in the day. so we are set up like this and for better audio i'm going to start the mic Ready? No, I'm not ready. Caleb has these these nice this nice couch that has buttons, like at the movie theater. <laughs> okay. I'm ready. Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. Wait, we'll just keep going. But how many times have you seen this movie? Do you think? I couldn't tell you. Too many. Like over fifteen. I watch them. Um, I watch all eight of them every year, for sure. All eight of them every, every year. year. Wow. So there's like nothing new about this. Yeah. Dumbledore. Dumbledore. <laughs> not me. Not Hermione. I did you. show her that TikTok. Yeah, you showed me that TikTok. To. After I finished the book. Then you're free to check the queen. Wrong. <laughs> no wrong. Private Drive doesn't look how I envisioned I it. completely forgot about Hagrid just like being excited to see him <laughs> I love Hagrid Scar is way smaller than I thought. Thought it was gonna be like Avatar and the Last Airbender. <laughs> so I saw that he actually says, "Wake up, cousin! We're going to the zoo." I always thought he said, "Wake up, Potter! We're going to the zoo." So he says that in the book or right now? I'm pretty sure in the book and the movie. If you put on subtitles, I'm pretty sure he says, "Cousin." Mm. Mr. Dursley also Sophia, passed away. I want everything to be perfect. For One less present than last year. How many are there? Thirty-six. Counted them myself. Thirty-six? But last year, last year I had thirty-seven. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, well, some of them are quite a bit bigger than last year. I don't care how big they are. The glasses fit him perfectly. Mm -hmm. Sorry about him. He doesn't understand what it's like. I learned all about this in the second book. Nice about him, what is it, tongue. serpent tongue? Apostle tongue. Apostle tongue. tongue. Apostle tongue. That's right. <laughs> oh my god. So over exaggerated. <laughs> yeah. I swear I don't know. One minute the glass was there and then it was gone. It was like magic. I could have had a good letter. Give it back. It's mine. Those owls are so pretty. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Can you imagine buying that property asking the real estate agent it's like i want to be in the middle of nowhere yeah sorry about that 
How do they make Hagrid so, look so big? You are breaking and entering. Um, probably like perspective shots. Dry up, dirty, you great prune. Happy birthday. Thank you. It's not every day your young man turns 11 now, is it? Hey, I mean, Harry, didn't you ever wonder where your mom and dad learned it all? Long, long. You're a wizard, Harry. You have been accepted at Hogwarts School and photographed a wizard ring. You're not becoming a tale. We great muggle like yourself, Scott, and stop him, are you? Muggle. Not magic folk. This boy's had his name down ever since you were born. <laughs> Oh my gosh! How weird would it be to just agree to just leave yeah. with this man? Well, you don't have much to lose. Yeah. Never noticed how the sign on like the pub it said the leaky cauldron. Didn't, well, it didn't say anything until I walk up to it, and then it like appeared, and then it was leaky mm -hmm. cauldron. Yeah. Please, I am Quirrell. Hello, Professor. I didn't see you there. Harry, this is Professor Quirrell. You'll be your defense against the dark arts, teacher. The music's so good, too. Mm -hmm. There's where you get your quills and your ink. Imagine how hard, like, just, like, how intricate the set design was. Mm -hmm. So at Universal Studios in Orlando, they have, like, all this now. really like they have the like a, a Harry Potter they world. have Diagon Alley now they have a Gringotts Bank wow I've been once but it was before they had like the how Gringotts long ago in 2014 oh, I've added a bunch as they come, goblins, but, not the most but they had the castle it was so cool. stay close. <laughs> we definitely have to go yeah I actually think like the makeup or whatever the costume of him like looks pretty good <laughs> yeah give it away Not. Like the sweetest old man ever. I know. Perhaps. That's what I was saying. The casting's perfect. Even like the smaller characters yes. are just. You can't imagine it being anybody else. Yeah. And maybe if you wrote it down. No, I can't spell it. Oh my gosh, they are all tall. And lanky. Yeah, And even the little Ginny, she's the same Ginny through all the movies really? too. Yeah. Fred, you next. They look so funny. I'm only joking. I am Fred. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's cool. They have so many shots of him doing that, like. <laughs> <laughs> Just in awe of everything. Yeah. He sees. that in Florida one time with every flavored beans mm -hmm. oh my Brody. god I almost threw up which one did you get I've done that before too I had booger it was like oh. salty it was oh. so it was the grossest thing ever that's so gross the vomit one is the worst why would you uh, oh are you doing magic let's see them she's so little her hair is perfect it's like poofy all the kids right there or throughout they, they, like the cast literally stayed the same it's so cool a lot of the a lot of his friends no one really changes like i said the only for sure cast member that changes is um dumbledore from the movie two to three that's because he passed away Look at the candlesticks. Did you imagine going first? I know. Why would she like go first? Son of a... Her last name starts with a G. Gryffindor! Come on, Dumbledore claps. 
<laughs> That's funny. Look at his brothers. They're so goofy looking. Harry Potter? Better be Gryffindor! Percy sucks. This way. You don't like Percy. This is the most direct path. Password. Capital Draconis. You know, in real life, Follow that password would be so easy to find come. out. Quickly, come on. In the book, they say, "Well, how did how did Gather they get in the common room? They don't know the password." Like that would be so Welcome easy to, to find out. It really is just how I pictured it. He stays the same. Yeah. I know I keep saying that, but it, you're like this. This guy stays the same. The entire cast pretty much stays the same. <gasps> I wanted to see this. Good afternoon, class. Good afternoon, class. There's a fantasy world I wish was real. Welcome to your first flying lesson. This is the one. Well, what are you waiting for? This would be so Everyone fun. Everyone, step up to the left side of their broomstick. Come on now, huh? I see a single broom in the air. The one riding it will find themselves out of Hogwarts before they can say Quidditch. I'm out of a room! A little prick. <laughs> What's the matter, Potter? Get beyond your reach! Imagine how cool it would be to go to school here. That's what I'm saying. Especially like when you're like a young kid, like 12, 13, that would be a blast. Doesn't Filch talk in the books? I actually can't remember. Yeah. Does he not talk in the movies? He does. What is his official job? Like, hall monitor? Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> something like that. They're kind of cute. This way. It's wicked fast and damn near impossible to see. What do I do with it? You catch it. Before the you doing, Olivia? You're so clever. Leviosa. Guardian Leviosa. Guardian Leviosa. No wonder she's got friends. I think she heard you. Meanie. Hi guys. So it's been a hot second. Um, we watched this this morning. And then my camera died, which very may, very well might happen again, because I only have one battery. So, we're halfway through the movie, we are at uh, the there Halloween might be scene. A, there might be a new battery for her birthday or Christmas. <laughs> Who knows? Yeah, we'll see, I guess. We'll see, I An guess. An extra battery. Yeah, so I hope it doesn't die again, so we're just gonna get right into it. But it looks like that where we paused was like a Halloween scene. Right? Yep. Um, and they're all in the... Well, you guys can see it on the screen. But they're, like, in the dining hall or whatever. So, let's get started. Three, two, one. Oh, yeah, that lighting's perfect. Tell Sylvia she wouldn't come out of the girls' bathroom. She said that she'd been in there all afternoon, crying. Did you bully girls? That word nerds, Caleb. I don't think so. I thought you were a nerd. What? I do not remember this. What? Hermione! She doesn't know! Oh, I do remember this. something mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. Hurry up. Ew. you've already seen this part 
However. Cool. They actually include a lot of stuff in the book and the movie. But they don't know what it is. <laughs> yeah, literally. Is it not obvious? Here is where I started watching. Thank you very much. I had a PlayStation 2 game that was it was called the Harry Potter Quidditch World Cup. And you're at the end, it was like a, you just played Quidditch the whole time. That's cool. It was cool. so much fun. You got to play in the beginning with the schools, and then after that, you got to play like on like country's national That's teams. Cool. That that face I laughed at whenever I watched it on YouTube. He's like, <laughs> take that side. They make all these like such bad guys. I know. Like you need to lower your voice so you sound more like the bad guy. Because when I watched this, at this point, I I still thought Snape was the bad guy. So now watching it, I want to look for Quirrell. Where's Quirrell? The top row up there. <laughs> they just had to have him stand on his yeah, broomstick. This is like, that's as extra as possible. Yeah. I don't want to complain about the story, but the scoring in Quidditch makes no sense. No, you, if you so get, you get t 10 points. For throwing the quaffle through the rings, but then you get 150 points if you catch a snitch and the game ends. And the game so ends. they'd have to... Throw the quaffle through the rings 15 times. Well, they said times. in the book that there was a there was a game that lasted three months. Yeah. <laughs> they said that in the book. They're like, because no one could catch the whatever. The snitch. All three of you. You're meddling in things that ought not to be meddled in. Queen to E5. I just think you heard that. <laughs> I just think this would be so cool that if this was real. Could you imagine yes. going to this crazy, crazy. school for an That's entire That's in a castle. Year? That's not and overpopulated. It's just like a close knit group group of people. Yeah. Then on top of it, you can stay there for Christmas if you want, but it's even a smaller group. Yes. Ron is literally the cutest kid I've ever seen in my life. Well, you can see his arm, so... He's not exactly invisible. It's the mirror. The mirror scene! You can see what his parents look like. <gasps> I'm pretty sure those actors uh, are the same. Stay, stay the same. Wow. Because they have a couple other scenes in the later movies. There has to be some sort of like huge plot twist in the last book or something. Is there? There has to be. I can't tell you anything. I'm sorry. I also definitely think Hermione and Harry are. Oh, we're gonna get together. He doesn't. the The mom definitely looks like what I thought, but not the the dad. I didn't realize he had the same glasses. His dad does. You said you watched this every year, and you know everything. Yes, I don't notice everything. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like I noticed that leaky cauldron thing in the beginning of the movie. Yeah, you see me, don't you? That's me. Cup. So then it shows us what we want. Whatever we want. Yes. It does not do to dwell on dreams. It does not do. Do, do. Okay. 
Caleb Allen Poe. Caleb's actually a descendant of Edgar Allan Poe. No. <laughs> the bit of light reading. This is light. I feel like that's us. Oh, <laughs> here it is. Nicholas, don't be too rude. Reading? Never heard of her. <laughs> it means you'll never die. <laughs> She's so iconic. He's got that means See, in the book. That means his upcoming birthday is his 666th in birthday. In the book, Harry finds out who Flamel is through Flamel. the Flamel through the card. You know what I'm saying? I haven't read the books in forever. <laughs> through the like baseball card or like not a baseball card, but through the, like the wizard's card, it says like Dumbledore and his friend Nicholas Flamel, and so he like uh. reads. The card, and he's like, "That's where I've seen the name." Gotcha. Through the wizard's card. That's what happens in the book. Oh, I think this is the dragon part you're talking about. I think Snape's trying to steal it. Snape. Yeah, it's in the Look oven. Look at that big dog. Looking thing. Is it a dog? Yeah, that's uh. I know he has an animal, but I didn't know it was a dog. What's his name? Wow. Look at the baby. Who's that? Malfoy. Malfoy. Oh dear. Draco Malfoy. Nothing. I repeat. That Nothing. stupid smirk on his face. Gives a student the right. Whatever. <laughs> okay, then I get fang. Fang. Just so you know. That's really creepy. <laughs> Don't fall asleep. I know, I'm getting dozy. I, I am too. Cat, this is Professor Dumbledore. Immediately. Oh wow, they jumped really. He's gone. We're like but near I the end of the book. Mm -hmm. This is about the soul. Up to something. Up to something. Wow, that's right. Now Neville, listen. We would No! I won't let you! You'll get Gryffindor into trouble again. Ow. Caleb. Do we need to stop? No, I'm good. We have 40 minutes left. I'm good. Good. I told you we should finish it tomorrow. Yeah, but then we can just watch the second one tomorrow. I have to say, this part is like what I was most excited to see. Like them going through all the different things. That's so scary. Right? Stop moving, both of you. This is Devil's Snare. You have to relax. If you don't, it'll only kill you for. Ooh! Not really a relic! Lucky Hermione pays attention in herbology. Wow. Was this the final one in the no. book too? The final one was drinking the liquids. Is this the final one in this? Yeah. As for me, I'll be a knight. Then you're free to check the king. No. Run, no! What is it? He's going to sacrifice himself. No, you can't! There must be another way! Do you want to stop Snape from getting that stumble or not? Harry, it's you that has to go on. I know it. Not me. Not Hermione. You. you. <laughs> I don't know why. That's funny now that I've seen that TikTok. He's going to sacrifice himself. <laughs> That's so scary. Get off of the horse. They're definitely gonna be. 
Don't tell me in the comments if they do. No spoilers. She's got those lovey dovey eyes. For Harry. Got those sleepy eyes. They're 11 years old. Whatever, you can still have a crush. I'm not allowed to say that because I know you had a crush at 11. Mm -hmm. Yeah, huh? No. I was focusing on coloring in my color book. Whatever. Come here, Potter! Now! Use the boy. Quirrell's not that scary looking, though. At least with his turban on. Yeah, he's kind of lame. Tell the truth! What do you see? So you are not strong enough. What? Harry what? I thought it was gonna be like a whole second head. Like on top of his head? Yes. So it's on it's behind his head. That's so creepy. He is creepy looking. That's so weird how this is like how I imagined it. Mm -hmm. We were listening to the soundtrack earlier. Soundtrack earlier. I said soundtracked because I'm used to saying urinary tract at work. Oh my God. <laughs> See, the book ends with him waking up at like the hospital wing. And Dumbledore tells him like how he, yeah, it ends with this. So I don't know what's gonna happen after the hospital wing. Only a person who wanted to find the stone, find it, but not use it, would be able to get it. And then he's a sweet old man. Bertie box, every mm -hmm. flavor beans. I was most unfortunate. Hermione's wearing a headband. All right, you. Yeah. Oh, I f okay, so I lied. There's actually this part in the book, too. There's another joke. Oh, man. Another year gone. Let me tell you later. And now, as I understand it, the House Cup needs awarding. And the points stand to Mr. Ronald Weasley for the best played game of chess that Hogwarts has seen these many years. 50 points. So what I was going to say is, there's a joke of, imagine working for these house points the entire year just for Dumbledore to give Gryffindor 210 points in, in one night. In, in one night. <laughs> yeah, when I heard that in the book and I, I was like, I guess that's okay. Because I don't like Slytherin, but like, that's not fair. Yeah, that's not fair at all. Okay, I think I'm too tired to give my final thoughts. You want to do that in the morning then? So I think I'm going to see you guys in the morning, and I'll tell you what my thoughts are. Bye. <laughs> okay, so final thoughts. Clearly Caleb and I are not good at couple YouTubers because we forgot to film our final thoughts the next morning. Also, I'm like so sick right now, so just please bear with my appearance. Um, I just took a shower. And my nose is like super charred from all the tissues I've used. So, um, I would say that I thoroughly enjoyed the movie. I wish I had a little more caffeine in me for the second half. I'm sure Caleb would agree with me. I really feel like I'll like this movie more having seen the other ones and read the other books. You know what I'm saying? Because I know from Caleb telling me that the books and the movies just get more and more.